everybody, and welcome back. I am here in uh, New Orleans, and uh, well, just outside of New Orleans, and uh, doing something a little bit different. Uh, rather than a chef interview at a food festival, I'm doing an eating challenge here at Bon Me Boys. Um, I have an hour to finish all of this, so let me give you a quick rundown of what we got. We got their, uh, we got ten of their pho dry spiced wings. Uh, we have a double order of this is their K Town fries. So we've got. Um, We've got kimchi, we've got the fried egg, um, I've got a couple other things around here. I've got grilled pork, I've got grilled shrimp, uh, this is their uh, bulgogi, and uh, the last one here I got the, the steak and egg. So, I have an hour to finish this. If I don't, uh, it's $125, but if I do, I will be the third person ever to finish this feat, uh, and the meal will be free. Let's get to it. Whew. All right, we are um, nine, just after nine minutes in. Did a lot of damage here. Um, I've got just a little bit of the shrimp. Um, I'm kind of separating things out a little bit as my game plan. The beautiful thing about this challenge is that you can toggle back and forth between all of these different flavors. Um, the shrimp, light, grilled, they were marinated before they got on there. Um, the chicken is great and crispy. There's this, a very salty um, pho flavor, and it's complemented with a little bit of heat um, from the sriracha and uh, a little bit of sweetness. Um, this is thick and heavy. I'm probably going to save this for last and make like a detritus sandwich with all of this stuff. Um, but uh, every single bite of this has been good. Um, the bulgogi beef has been great. Um, the, the, the kimchi on here gives a nice vegetable crunch. I love the fact that in this challenge, unlike a lot of other burger challenges and whatnot, there's actually a lot of vegetables on here. A lot of like bright, crisp things to help clean your palate. So I gotta keep eating because we're 10 minutes in, but uh, we'll check in here in a little bit. So we are um, just over 18 minutes in. It's an hour-long challenge, so I'm sitting real pretty. All of the interiors of uh, all of the bond mains are done. The wings are left for just a little bit of a um, kind of soggy skin that I'm probably going to use to make the buns. These buns are really actually delicious. They're crusty on the outside, fluffy on the inside. I am just leaving them to the end as a strategy. Please don't let that um, avoid anything on that. These buns are absolutely amazing. Um, I got a lot of fries to go here. Um, the K Town fries are really the way to go. Uh, I have seen a couple orders of the. Um, uh, southern crack fries, and those look amazing too, uh, but uh, I, had, I had to go with something that had some kimchi on it. The, the mayo is a bit of a double-edged sword. It's very flavorful, so it really mixes up, uh, you know, prevents the uh, flavor exhaustion, but at the same time, it's creamy and it's heavy. So we'll see how that goes, but I got uh, about 41 minutes left and plenty of carbs to go. Wish me luck. We are just over 30 minutes in, and as you can see, as I try and clear some of this to try this, we are in the final steps. Um, I gotta say, actually, I'm glad that I saved chicken till the very end. It's like the sweetness and the crunchiness, it's like a savory dessert almost. I said it before, easily the best part about this challenge was that there were so many different components to it, different textures, different flavors, sweet, sour, crunchy, creamy. Mm. This is definitely, well, I'm definitely getting up there full. This is not for the faint of heart. This is definitely going to be one of my uh, favorite eating challenges to complete. And $125 for the free food ain't bad. And that, what, does this challenge have a name? No, I don't have a name for it. Well, that is the Bun Me Brothers. Four extra Bun Me, one extra Big Fry, and 10 Wings Challenge. Thank you.